Whether you love science or not, you probably heard of a guy named Newton. I mean the one who discovered gravity while sitting under an apple tree. Do you know in 2010 an astronaut took a piece of that tree into space to honor the Newton or maybe to tease him? And you know what else astronauts take into space? Food and water. And you've probably seen a lot of documentaries and movies which show how water floats as a drop in space. But what will happen if you pour that water outside the space shuttle in vacuum of space? Will it freeze or will it boil? Hey everyone, this is Tao Science, simplified science to make you smarter. Earth is one of the very few places in the universe where water exists in liquid state. Standing near an ocean might seem like there's a lot of it, but believe me, in space you might have to travel light years before you can get a single drop of water, and even that when you're lucky. To stay liquid, water needs very specific temperature and pressure conditions. As you move up into atmosphere, water boils at lower temperature. At sea level, it's 100 degrees Celsius or 212 degrees Fahrenheit. But as you move up, it starts reducing to 90, 80. I mean, you get the idea. It happens because the large atmospheric pressure keep pushing the water molecules downward, making it very hard for them to escape. Water molecules are always moving. If atmospheric pressure is not there to push them, they start escaping as gas pretty easily. So now you must be thinking, if that's the case, and you keep taking water upwards all the way to space, it'll boil, right? Because there is no pressure in space. But there's another important thing that we need to consider. Space is very cold. The temperature in space is minus 270 degrees Celsius or minus 455 degrees Fahrenheit. And water freezes way before that. So the question arises, will the lack of pressure boil it? or low temperature freezes it. The answer boils down to, boils down, get it? Which will get it first? And ironically, it's boiling. Now you get it. Because the pressure vacuum results into instant boiling way before the coal gets it. But wait, it's not over for water yet. It has yet to endure all kinds of torture because space is, I mean, space is cruel. Now the water is in gaseous state and in very cold environment. And because of that, it immediately freezes into nice ice crystals. So if you put water into space, it first boils and then freezes. Pretty cool, right? I mean, who would have thought that? Except for some astronauts who took a leak and expelled it out into space to confirm this theory. I mean, the sacrifices people have to make for science. Please hit the subscribe button if you want to see more videos like this. Don't forget to hit the notification bell, like, comment and share. And as always, keep learning, keep exploring until you know everything.